Today, let's build a small, carry-on sized capsule wardrobe for your next beach vacation. The key to an easy and relaxing vacation is packing light. So today, let's put together a list of essentials for the ultimate tropical vacation capsule wardrobe and show you how you can customize it to your personal style. I feel like when we're looking forward to our vacation style, we're in one of two camps. We either want to go really minimal, neutral, and effortless, or we want to go super bright, energetic, and colorful. So let's see how we can take one small packing list and create two completely separate vibes for our vacation capsule wardrobe. Before we get started, let's talk about some quick tips for getting the most out of a minimal capsule wardrobe. First, don't repeat silhouettes. Make sure that you aren't packing multiples of the same item unless you absolutely need them. Try to vary your colors too, even if that means just choosing a lighter or darker shade of the same color. This will ensure you can create a very large variety of outfits with a small number of items. Similarly, focus on separates. Separates are another way to add a variety of silhouettes to your capsule without adding too many items. As long as you've followed the first tip and all of your separates vary in both cut and color, you'll be able to create so many different outfits from your minimal wardrobe. A dress can only be worn in so many ways, but a top and skirt can be mixed and matched with all of the other items in your capsule. Choose a cohesive color palette. While we want to be sure to include a lot of variety in our capsules, a cohesive color palette is key if you want to take advantage of the previous two tips to mix and match all of your items. If you want to learn more about creating your perfect color palette, I'll link my color harmony playlist in the description box below. Finally, play with patterns, especially in a neutral capsule. Creating visual interest is one of the most important aspects of a well-executed personal style. And when you're working with a very small number of items, adding pattern is a very efficient way to include more visual interest without adding bulk to your carry-on. If you're not a fan of pattern, choose some bold accessories instead, like a pair of statement earrings or sunglasses. Now that we've learned how to get the most out of a small wardrobe, let's start building our minimal travel capsules, starting with tops. No matter what other items you bring on your beach vacation, one of the most versatile items you can have is a oversized button-up shirt. Wear it as a layering piece to keep warm while you're traveling, on its own on an evening out, as a jacket, or even as a cover-up. Along these lines, I would also recommend bringing a light, open-knit sweater, or maybe a sweater with some cutout details that can provide some warmth without making it too hot. Another must-have would be some sort of a dressy top, which you can wear to elevate your outfits when you don't want to wear a dress. A sleeveless top with some interesting details is a great option for those hot climates. Finally, some form of a t-shirt or a tank top are must-have basics for any travel capsule. For the neutral capsule, let's add a white longline button-up shirt, light and breezy white t-shirt, nude open knit sweater, beige tank top, and a white halter neck top. For the colorful capsule, let's add a purple button up shirt, double strap tank top, pink peplum halter top, lavender t-shirt, and cream sweater with these amazing shoulder cutouts and colorful stripes down the sleeve. When choosing bottoms, let's make sure we cover multiple silhouettes by choosing one skirt, one pair of shorts, and one pair of pants. For the neutral capsule, a tropical print skirt will bring some visual interest into the otherwise blended color palette. A pair of white denim shorts and some neutral wide leg jeans are also great options. For the colorful capsule, I'm actually going to keep the bottoms pretty neutral with this white wrap skirt, blue denim shorts, and the same pair of neutral wide leg jeans. This will ensure that all of my tops match my bottoms and that we can add some colorful accessories without overwhelming the looks. Next, a dress is an essential for any vacation packing list. It's your one and done occasion wear piece to look dressed up for any dinner or event, even when worn with a simple pair of flats. For the neutral capsule, this lavender halter dress adds just a little bit of playfulness to the otherwise neutral capsule. For the colorful capsule, I chose two dresses, one strapless blue dress for a more formal nighttime option, and this floaty orange dress which could be worn during the daytime with some flats, in the evening with heels, or as a beach cover-up. For jackets, it's always a great idea to try to include one short jacket and one long jacket. For warm climates, an open knit long line cardigan is a great option for that longer layering piece. 
While somewhat counterintuitive, a long layering piece brings a lot of versatility to a warm weather capsule by providing an opportunity to create some drama in a variety of different looks. I chose the same jackets for both capsules, one slightly oversized denim jacket and one long open knit cardigan. When traveling for any beach or resort vacation, I recommend packing no less than two bathing suits. This allows time for one bathing suit to be properly washed and dried while the other one is being used. For the neutral capsule, I chose this unique cutout bathing suit in a nude color and this black bikini with an asymmetrical strap. For the colorful capsule, this bright pink one piece is a bold statement while this lavender bikini is colorful but understated. Comfortable shoes are key for any travel capsule wardrobe, so let's make sure to pack at least one pair of comfortable flats. A pair of dressier shoes for more formal occasions is also a must, but be sure to choose something with a manageable heel. For the neutral capsule, a pair of cool leather slides and a pair of neutral sneakers are great options. For the colorful capsule, let's go for these comfortable orange slip-ons and a pair of low-heeled blue strappy sandals. Finally, let's talk about some essential accessories. A bag, a pair of statement earrings, and a pair of sunglasses are my go-tos. For the neutral capsule, this beaded bag, silver earrings, and tortoiseshell aviator sunglasses will match well with all of the outfits. And for the colorful capsule, a multicolored clutch and rainbow beaded earrings will add just a little extra color to each outfit. And let's add the same aviator sunglasses as well. Another great item to grab for the beach would be some sort of brimmed hat or ball cap. The total packing list includes 18 essential items. One oversized button down shirt, one t-shirt, one tank top, one dressy top, and one light sweater, one skirt, one pair of shorts, and one pair of long pants, one dress, a one-piece swimsuit, one bikini, one short jacket and one long jacket, one pair of comfortable flats, one pair of dressy shoes, one bag, one pair of earrings, and one pair of sunglasses. Each individual capsule includes 19 items and can create about 40 interchangeable outfits. Or if you want to combine the two, you get 34 items and at least 100 interchangeable outfits. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it inspires you to pack light and pack smart for your next tropical vacation. If you genuinely like this video or found it useful, please give it a like and subscribe for more personal style and capsule wardrobe videos. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.